Hi everyone, this is Dali here and I'm just going to show you another video of how to install or flash a firmware or a Samsung phone. If your phone is stuck on a logo or has crashed, doesn't work properly, doesn't boot, boot loop only, you need to do this one. So my phone is connected to the um, computer but the Smart switch does not recognize it because it doesn't boot or it doesn't start. So we would need to go to emergency software recovery. Which we don't want to go to that. Next option is device initialization. Once you go there, you would need to figure your device model number exactly what it is. So mine is Atom N900. And we press search. Okay, let's see. It's in Serial number we need to put in. To find the serial number, you would need to go to back of your phone, take the battery off, and you'll see serial number there. Which starts such and such, so when you do so after putting your serial number, press OK. OK, what's going on with it? Press OK. I'm able to find the serial number, model number, on my own server. Please check and try it again. Okay, there's a mistake in the serial number, we correct that and press OK. Okay, there we go, we got it. Now we will start the process of um, so you just follow the screen and it will install some basic files for your Note 3. You can see this it says Samsung Galaxy Note 3. In previous video I showed you how to do a custom recovery firmware installation via Odin if you want to downgrade or upgrade but in this one I am showing you how to do official one this is gonna, this is the Samsung server that that does the official installation for your Samsung phone so the next thing will ask you to put your phone into recovery mode Right, I don't know what's happening in here. There you go. It's asking to put your phone onto recovery mode. To do so, you'd need to press and hold the volume down button, the home button, and the power button all together and a blue screen would come up and you just press the volume up 
and that will change it to be recovery mode, which I am in now. So once you are there, you just press OK. What's going to happen next is the, the, the software will install, will download the uh, software for your phone. Once it's done, um, it will install it anyway. So from here, you don't need to do anything else. Just sit back and watch. Don't even have to watch. It will take up to an hour time. It will download the software and then it will install the software in both ways. So your phone will be properly and fully functioned with a fresh official firmware. So this is how you do it. I'm not going to keep recording this one because it will take an hour time. So uh, the video will end up here now because everything is done and you don't have to do anything. You don't have to press anything. It will download the software and it will install the software for you. And that's it. So thumbs up guys, share, subscribe and I will see you soon. Ta-da!